ಸದಾಶಿವಸಮಾರಂಭಾಚಾರ್ಯಮಧ್ಯಮಾಚಾರ್ಯಪರ್ಯಂತಾ ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪರಂಪರಂ ಸುಖ ನಿತ್ಯ ಸ್ವಪ್ರಕಾಶ ವ್ಯಾಪಕ ನಾಮಿಷ್ಠಾನ ಬುಧ್ಯಬೋಧ್ಯ ಬುಧೇರ್ದೃಗ್ಯಪ್ತು ನಿರ್ಮಲ ಅಪಾರಂ ಸರ್ವೇದೇದ್ಯ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ಪರ ಮಹ ತದೇವಾಹಂ ನಮತ್ತೋನ್ಯದಿ ಮೇ ನಿಶ್ಚಿತ ಮತಿ ವಿಚಾರ ಸಾಗರ ಫಿಫ್ತ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಪೇಜ್ ಒನ್ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಟಾಪಿಕ್ ಟು ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಲೈನ್ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಲೈನ್ ಸ್ವಶಬ್ದೇನ ಶುದ್ಧ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೋಚ್ಯತೆ ತದೇವ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಜ್ಞಾನ ಸ್ಯಾಶ್ರಯೋತಿ ತದೇವ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಜ್ಞಾನೇನಾವ್ರಿಯತೆ ತಸ್ಮಾನ ಸ್ವಾಶ್ರಯಸ್ವಿಷಯಕ ವಿಷಯಕಮಿತ್ಯುಚ್ಯತೆ ವಿಷಯ ಆವೃತ್ತ ಸಂಕ್ಷೇಪ ಶಾರೀರಕ ವಿವರಣ ವೇದಾಂತ ಮುಕ್ತಾವಲೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಸಿದ್ಧಿ ಅದ್ವೈತ ದೀಪಿಕಾದಿಗ್ರಂಥೇಶು ಅಜ್ಞಾನ ಸ್ವಾಶ್ರಯ ವಿಷಯಕಮಿತಿ ವರ್ಣಿತ ಹೈಲಿ ಟೆಕ್ನಿಕಲ್ ಪೋರ್ಷನ್ ನಿಶ್ಚಲದಾಸ ಈಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟಿಂಗ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ದ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಷನ್ ಡಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ವ್ಯೂಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ಆಚಾರ್ಯಸ್ in advaitam itself there are two groups advaita vedanta group number 1 advaita vedanta group number 2 that he is going to present from the next topic that is 257 before that he has to establish that this jagat srishti is mithya already established prapancha srishti hi nasti eva consistently advaita vedantin groups are refuting the real creation real srishti is not there mandukya upanishad gaudapada acharya writes in vaitathya prakaranam second chapter 32nd shloka nani rodho na chotpatti hi navaddho na cha sadhakah namu mukshurna vai muktah ಪರಮಾರ್ಥತ ದೆರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಬಂಧ ದೆರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಮೋಕ್ಷ ದೆರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಸೀಕರ್ ದೆರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಸಾಟ್ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ಎನಿ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ನ ಬದ್ಧ ನ ಚ ಸಾಧಕ ನ ಮುಕ್ಷು ನ ವೈ ಮುಕ್ತ ದೆರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಒನ್ ಲಿಬರೇಟೆಡ್ there is no real liberation and liberated person iti esha paramarthata this is the absolute truth and in advaita prakaranam third chapter also the last 48th verse karika 
Gaudapadacharya said, nothing is born, nothing is go away. Jeevas are not born. Nakastit jayate jeevaha sambhavusya navidyate etattad uttamam satyam uttamam satyam yatra kinchinna jayate where nothing is born. Brahman is not the cause. Na param uh, na aparam Brahma. Brahman is neither cause nor effect. That uh, is the answer for Uttamadhikaris. No creation, no mumukshu, na bandaha, na mokshaha. Where is the creation? Creation is not there. But, but this is not very easy for all people to understand. Not even all people, even Vedantic students also, those who are Madhyamadhikaris, mediocre students sake, Upanishad introduce the Srishti. Upanishad itself introduced the Srishti. Otherwise, people will ask, if you, the Advaitin, says there is no creation at all, there is no Baddhaha, there is no Muktaha, whole Vedanta becomes redundant, whole Karmakanda becomes redundant. Upanishads are talking about the Srishti. How you reconcile that? For that, uh, Acharyas writes, there are pramanams, Kathopanishat pramanam is there, Najayate mriyateva vipaschat nayam bhabhuva kutaschinna. Nothing is born, nothing is going to die. In. Where is the creation? That only Lord Krishna borrows in Bhagavad Gita also. Najayate mriyateva kadachit. Nayam bhutva bhavita vana bhuyaha ajonitya shashvato yam puranaha nahanyate hanyamane sharire. Whole thing Krishna copied from the Upanishads. In spite of listening Bhagavad Gita, in spite of listening Upanishad vakyams, but there are some Madhyamadhikaris. For their sake, Upanishad introduce the Srishti. How that Srishti has to be interpreted? How Upanishad can contradict? One place uh, creation is there, another place uh, creation is not there, it says. Is it Upanishad confused? Or it wants to confuse us? Neither Upanishad is confused nor it wants to confuse us. There is no pramana dosha. Pramata alone has to understand properly. Interpretational problems. All are interpretational problems. Therefore, interpret properly. Then you understand Upanishad. Both the statements, creation is not there. Creation is there. Both you can... Uh, accommodate in the same Upanishad beautifully. How that beauty we have to see in the Upanishad? Present in such a way where there is no contradiction in between the Upanishadic statements. Srishti Vakyams, Srishti Nishedha Vakyams of Upanishad should not have any contradiction. That is the job Shankaracharya, Adi Shankaracharya did. Otherwise, Upanishad is contradicting itself. We have to think why Shankaracharya is the giant of this um, Advaita Vedanta. Na? Because of the truth here. There is no way out. You have to accept it. Veda never tell lies. Then how we have to interpret? This is the topic now. So, we have to interpret that, uh, introduce the Srishti. 
how we have to introduce the srishti first we will see that sankhya philosopher also talk about the srishti vishishta advaiti also talk about the srishti that means how they introduce what is their conclusion how we introduce what is our conclusion this must be very clear sankhya philosopher says prakriti is the karanam for this srishti prakriti is the karanam for this srishti then that prakriti which is the karanam for srishti is satyam who says sankhya philosopher says prakriti is satyam its product universe is also satyam that is why for sankhya philosophers they are dvaitins prakriti is satyam and jagat is satyam duality has come this is one example then second example vishishta advaiti says the srishti is born out of maya srishti is born out of maya maya is the cause universe is the product maya is the cause universe is the product we also say the same thing maya is the cause jagat is the product par madhyama adhikari se vedanta introduced the srishti maya as the cause upadana karanam but there is a difference according to vishishta advaiti maya is satyam from satya maya real maya what comes real universe only will come therefore jagat is also satyam for whom for vishishta advaiti also because world comes out of satya maya therefore jagat is also satyam therefore duality what duality maya is there and jagat is there then parmatma is there so duality but how vedantin introduce this srishti we have to introduce this srishti because upanishad talks about srishti introducing srishti alone is not sufficient upanishad is negating srishti that also we have to answer therefore let us see first how upanishad uh, introduces srishti you have to interpret in such a way it will not contradict the srishti nisheda later that way we have to interpret very 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 subtle subject you need a lot of attention i will try my best to communicate you try your best to understand okay so now advaitin has to interpret maya as ajnanam if you take maya as the cause of creation as vishishta advaiti dvaitam will come jagat will become satyam therefore another name of maya is moola vidya another name of maya is moola vidya moola vidya another name only they call sankhya people call as prakriti and uh, another name for moola vidya is ajnanam avidya means ajnanam basic ignorance ignorance is not about uh, physics ignorance chemistry ignorance computer ignorance or any other ignorance physics ignorance computer ignorance other world ignorances whatever you are having they are called thula vidya they are not moola vidya they come under thula vidya other than atma ajnanam whatever ajnanam you have they come under thula vidya you know this 
we used this word many times in Vichara Sagara itself. Here Upanishad is talking, Acharyas are talking about Mula Vidya, basic ignorance. Mula Vidya means what? Atma Ajnanam. Thula Vidya is Anatma Ajnanam. Mula Vidya is Atma Ajnanam. Correct? Now, we replace the Maya word by Mula Vidya. Ajnanam, ignorance, basic ignorance, Mula Vidya, Atma Ajnanam, Atma Ajnanam. Through this uh, Maya, which we are calling Brahmashraya Maya Sattva Rajasthamo Gunatmika Maya Asti, Brahmashraya. Where is this ignorance is the question now. That is the topic in this paragraph. Where is this ignorance is resting upon? What is the ashraya of uh, ignorance? Atma Ajnanam is resting where? What is its locus? It must exist somewhere. Hmm? It must exist somewhere. Where it exists? Will it exist in the creation? Creation has not yet come. We are going to talk about the creation. Avidya is anadi, beginningless time it is there. That means before creation itself, Brahmashraya Maya, which is nothing but Mula Avidya, Asti. So therefore, it cannot exist in the world because world has not yet come. Creation has not yet emerged out. Creation has to come. Then where is this Ajnana? Where it is resting? Mula Vidya. Can you say this Mula Vidya is existing in uh, Jiva, individual? Atma Ajnana resting upon, located in Jiva, can you say? You cannot say that also, because jivas are not born at all, creation has not yet started, srishti has to be introduced, jivas are also ruled out. So, mula avidya, anadi avidya cannot exist even in jiva. It cannot be located in jiva because jiva hai hi nai, jiva has not yet born. Second option also ruled out. Can we say this Mula Vidya or Ajnanam resting upon Ishvara or resting in Ishvara? Can Ishvara be the location of Mula Vidya? Means that is also not possible. That is also not possible because Ishwara job is only to create jivas. Ishwara has not yet come. Jiva Ishwara division is not at all started before creation. Ekameva dvitiyam sadeva somya idam agra asit agre idam atma eva asit. No dvitiya vastu. Subject object division is not there. Jiva Ishwara concept has not at all arrived before creation. Jiva Ishwara, Ishwara is Ishwara because of Jiva. Jiva is Jiva because of Ishwara. Both are interdependent. Jiva gives the job to Ishwara, Ishwara becomes an employer. Gives job to jivas also to exhaust their punya papa karma. So, jiva and ishvara both the concept has not yet started. We are talking about the before creation. Mula vidya is always Brahmashraya. Brahman is not born before creation itself, Brahman was there. Anadi. 
Brahman is birthless, nityam, eternal, always there. So, Ishwara also ruled out. Jagat is ruled out, Ish Jiva is ruled out, Ishwara is ruled out. Then where this Ajnanam is resting, where it is located, only one place, Tattva Bodha, care of Tattva Bodha, Brahma, Shraya, Maya, Maya, another name is Mula Vidya, that Mula Vidya is Brahma, Shraya. Ajnanam is Brahma Ashraya. Self ignorance is located in Brahman only. This is the possibility, no other possibility. Then, what is Ajnanam when we talk? Ignorance of what? What is the object of ignorance? That question will come. It has to come. <laughs> okay. Ignorance. Ignorance of what? Last class I said, Atma. Atma is the Vishaya of Ajnanam. Or Brahman is the Vishaya of Ajnanam. Ajnanam is about Brahman. Brahman is the Vishaya. That Vishaya alone is, is uh, presented as Avrutatvam. In this uh, fifth line, if you see, Vishayatvam Avrutatvam. Ajnanam is covering the Brahman. Ajnanam is covering the Brahman. Ajnanam is that which makes uh, the things are not known. Brahman is not known, Atma is not known, Atma Ajnanam. Atma Ajnanam is where? Located in Atma. What is the object of ignorance? Atma or Brahman. That is the topic we are seeing now. Very, very interesting and mind-boggling subject. So, Brahma Shritam Ajnanam, Brahma Adhishthanakam Ajnanam, Mithya Prapamcham Srijati. That Ajnanam alone generate the seeming world or unreal world, Mithya Prapanchaha. So, Ajnanasya Ashrayaha Brahma Eva. Ajnanasya Vishayaha Api Brahma Eva. Ignorance is resting in Brahman. Ignorance uh, about Brahman. Like uh, what example is given there in the above line, second line? Grihashritam Tamaha Yatha Grihame Eva Abrunoti. Do you remember? One week over. Hmm? Uh, the darkness in the room. Where it is located? In the room. Dark room, we say. Where is the darkness located? In the room. Darkness is located in the room. Then, darkness vishaya is what? It is uh, making, and uh, darkness is andhakara. Andhakara is in the room. What is its function? <laughs> It is covering the room. Darkness, Andhakara, making the room not to know what are the things are there in the room. That is what is said in the second line you see. Grihadi, Grihashritam Tamaha Andhakaraha Yatha Grihameva Abrinoti. See, locating in the room and uh, darkening the room. <laughs> think, think. Where it is located, it makes that room not to know anything in that room. How is this darkness staying in the room, locating in the room and not uh, allowing the room to know how, where this window is, where the door is, where the cupboard is. 
गृहम आवृणोति अयमेव स्वाश्रयस्व विषयक विषयकत्व पक्षः इति उच्यते सो आश्रयत्व विषयम आश्रयम इज आल्सो रूम ओनली विषय इज आल्सो रूम ओनली फॉर अंधकार अंधकार से आश्रय गृहमेव अंधकार से विषय गृहमेव सो अज्ञान से तदव सिमिलरली सिमिलरली हियर आलो हियर वी हव टू अंडर्स्टैंड क्लियरली अज्ञान हेज गाट टू पवर्स अज्ञान मीनस अज्ञान इज इक्वल टू मूला विद्या मूला विद्या इज इक्वल टू माया वी आर रिप्लेसिंग द माया एज मूला विद्या हियर बिकॉज इफ यू टेक माया विल बिकम विशिष्ट द्वैतिन माया अन सत्यम देर फोर वी हव टू टेक् अज्ञान हियर मूला विद्या अनदर मीनिंग आफ माया सो विक्षेप शक्ति आवरण शक्ति नव वेर इज इट ब्रह्म ब्रह्माश्रय माया मूला विद्या अस्ती दिस विक्षेप शक्ति आवरण शक्ति आफ ब्रह्म अज्ञान विल नाट कवर् द ब्रह्म विक्षेप शक्ति आफ अज्ञान इज प्रधान इन द सृष्टि टाइम आर यू लिजनिंग केरफुली आर यू कमिंग अलांग वि मै वर्ड्स विक्षेप शक्ति आवरण शक्ति आफ मूला विद्या और माया डज नाट फंक्शन सेम वे विथ रिगार्ड टू ब्रह्म बिकॉज अज्ञान इज लोकेटेड इन ब्रह्म ब्रह्म कैनाट बी कवर्ड विक्षेप प्रधान टू क्रियेट दिस क्रियेशन विक्षेप शक्ति इज ऐक्टिवेटेड दस वै वे अज्ञान मेक् यूज ऑफ इट्स विक्षेप शक्ति अज्ञान कैनाट क्रियेट दि क्रियेशन अलोन शुद्ध ब्रह्म आलो कैनाट क्रियेट देर फोर माया सहित ब्रह्म आर् मूला विद्या सहित ब्रह्म ईश्वर इतुच्यते ईश्वर कम दैट ईश्वर इज द काज ऑफ दिस् क्रियेशन हुच ईश्वर ईश्वर हैविंग मूला विद्या प्लस ब्रह्म मिसेस ब्रह्म मिसेस ब्रह्म मिसेस मिस्टर माया माया आर अज्ञान वी हव टू यूज केयरफुल हियर मूला विद्या इंस्टेड ऑफ माया माया आर मूला विद्या आई एम गोइंग टू यूज ओनली मूला विद्या नाट माया नौ मूला विद्या अलॉन्ग वि ब्रह्म स्टार्ट क्रियेशन अब पेर अंद मूला विद्या ब्रह्म स्टार्टिंग क्रियेशन ईश्वरा ईश्वर इज द जगत्कर्ता सृष्टिकर्ता सृष्टि स्थितिकर्ता लयकर्ता ब्यूटिफुली वी स्टार्ट फॉर मध्यम अधिकारी से इलाद और क्रियेशन उंड पड़ी काह और कड़वल ने वे कर्मयोग उपासन योग पणु ईश्वर भक्ति पणु अच्छेण वट टू डू वि हव टू से बिकाज वी मीन उपनिषत् इज टेली उपनिषत् अलोन इज टेलिंग मै डिर् फॉर युवर सेक् ई विल इंट्रड्यूस द क्रियेशन टेमपररी क्रियेशन अंटिल यू बिकम ए उत्तम अधिकारी मेक् यूज ऑफ दिस टेमपररी क्रियेशन दट ईज वै ई से दिस् क्रियेशन उपनिषत् मिथ्या सीमिंगली रियल एक्सपीरियशली रियल मेक् यूज ऑफ दिस् क्रियेशन For your sake, I have introduced Upanishad is talking. Swami ni Satya Pratnam Dharananda is not talking. What is Upanishad is telling? I am telling that sal. <laughs> not Satya Pratnamananda Swami ni's words. Upanishadic words uh, I am presenting that sal. Oh, my dear Madhyama Adhikari, make use of this creation until you become a senior student. Make use of this Ishvara and have a bhakti, upasana, etc., etc. One day or other, you will come to understand hmm, 
ಪಾಟೀಸೀಶ್ವರಾ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಅವಿದ್ಯಾ ಆಲ್ ಯು ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಲೇಟರ್ ಸೊ ಫಾರ್ ಮಧ್ಯಮ ಅಧಿಕಾರಿ ಸೇಕ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಂಪ್ಯಾಷನ್ ವೆನ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಈಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಟೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಂಪ್ಯಾಷನ್ ಗುರು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಸೇ ವಾಟ್ ನೋ 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 ಐ ಡೋಂಟ್ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಟಾಕ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಮಿಥ್ಯಾ ಪ್ರಪಂಚ ಅನ್ನ ಪೋ ಪೋನ್ ಸುಲ್ವ ಅಂದ ಗುರು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಟೀಚ್ ಅಲಾಂಗ್ ವಿತ್ ದ ಉಪನಿಷದಿಕ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಈವೆನ್ ದೋ ಗುರು ಈಸ್ ಎ ಜ್ಞಾನಿ ಗುರು ಈಸ್ ಉತ್ತಮ ಅಧಿಕಾರಿ ಗುರು ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಸಚ್ ಅಧಿಕಾರಿ ಅಂತ ಸೊಲ್ಲ ಕೂಡ ಅದು ಗುರು ಈಸ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ನ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟುಡ್ ದಿ ಟ್ರೂತ್ ಬಟ್ ಗುರು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಂಪ್ಯಾಷನ್ ಗುರು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಡೌನ್ ಟು ಟೀಚ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ನಿಶ್ಚಲದಾಸ ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ವಾಟ್ ನಿಶ್ಚಲದಾಸ ಸೈಡ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಟೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಯು ದಟ್ ಸಾಲ್ ಓಕೆ ಓಕೆ ವಾಟ್ ನಾವು ಅಜ್ಞಾನ ಕೆನ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ಎನಿ ವೇರ್ ಅದರ್ ದ್ಯಾನ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ neither jeeva nor ishwara nor world because the three of them have not yet come they have to come so until that time ajnanam is only with brahman <coughs> until that time na apra eppadi samana apra gane eppome brahman lo da irukku moola vidya okay uh, <coughs> then what in uh, uh, maya panchakam shankaracharya writes ಆ ದಿಸ್ ಅಜ್ಞಾನ ಆಫ್ಟ ಸ್ಟೇಯಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ವಿಷಯಕಮನ್ನು ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಆವೃಣೋತಿ ಆವೃತತ್ವ ಇಟ್ ಕವರ್ಸ್ ದ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಸಿಟ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಲಿಸನಿಂಗ್ ಟು ವಿಚಾರ ಸಾಗರ ಬೀಯಿಂಗ್ ಎ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ವೈ ಯು ಆರ್ ಲಿಸನಿಂಗ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ಇಯರ್ಸ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಅಜ್ಞಾನ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವೈ ಯು ಆರ್ ಲಿಸನಿಂಗ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಅಜ್ಞಾನ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ correct that atma ajnanam is because of this mula vidya it covers the brahman as it were really it cannot cover as it were what maya panchakam says first shloka nirupama anit nirupama nitya niramshake akhande niramshake pyakande mai ಚಿತಿ ಸರ್ವ ವಿಕಲ್ಪನಾದಿ ಶೂನ್ಯೆ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಶ್ಲೋಕ ಆಫ್ ಮಾಯ ಪಂಚಕಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ನಿರುಪಮ ಇನ್ಕಾಂಪರಬಲ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಅನ್ವಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಎಟರ್ನಲ್ ಅನ್ವಿ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಬುಕ್ ವಿಚಾರ ಸಾಗರ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಕೋಟಿಂಗ್ ದ ಮಾಯ ಪಂಚಕಂ ನಿರ ನಿರಂಶಕ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಲೆಸ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಅಖಂಡ ಡಿವಿಷನ್ಲೆಸ್ ಚಿತ್ ಮೈ ಇನ್ ಮೀ ದಿ ಚಿತಿ ಕಾನ್ಷಿಯಸ್ನೆಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಡಸ್ ಸರ್ವ ವಿಕಲ್ಪನಾದಿ ಶೂನ್ಯೆ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಫ್ರೀ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಆಲ್ ವಿಕಲ್ಪಾಸ್ ಪ್ರಮಾತ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ಪ್ರಮೇಯ ತ್ರಿಪುಟಿ ನಾಸ್ತಿ ಕರ್ತ ಕರ್ಣ ಕರ್ಮ ತ್ರಿಪುಟಿ ನಾಸ್ತಿ ಈವೆನ್ ದೆನ್ ಘಟಯತಿ ಜಗದೀಶ ಜೀವ ಭೇದಂ ದಿಸ್ ಮಾಯಾ ಈಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾಪಬಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಅಘಟಿತ ಘಟನಾ ಪಟೀಯಸಿ ಮಾಯಾ ದಿಸ್ ಮಾಯಾ ಈಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾಪಬಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ವಾಟ್ ಕೆನ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ಡನ್ ಇಟ್ ಮೇಕ್ಸ್ ದ ಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಮೇಕ್ಸ್ ದ ಇಂಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ಅಘಟಿತ ಘಟನಾ ಪಟೀಯಸಿ ಮಾಯ ವಾಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಡಸ್ ಘಟಯತಿ ಜಗತ್ ಜನರೇಟ್ಸ್ ದ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಷನ್ ಸೃಷ್ಟಿ ಈಶ ಈಶ್ವರ ಎ ಸೃಷ್ಟಿಕರ್ತ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಜೀವ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ದ ವಿಕ್ಟಿಮ್ ಥಿಂಕಿಂಗ್ ಐ ಮೇ ವಿಕ್ಟಿಮ್ ಐ ಮೇ ಸಫರಿಂಗ್ ವಿತ್ ವಾಧಿ ಓಲ್ಡ್ ಏಜ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ಐ ಮೇ ವಿಕ್ಟಿಮೈಸ್ ವಿಕ್ಟಿಮ್ ಓ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಈಸ್ ವಿಕ್ಟಿಮೈಸರ್ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಈಸ್ ಸೇವಿಯರ್ ಒಂದು ಅಚ್ಚ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗ್ಯುಲರ್ ಫಾರ್ಮೇಟನ್ನ ದ ಮಾಯ ಡಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಜಾಬ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವೈ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಡಿವಿಷನ್ಲೆಸ್ ಬಟ್ ಮಾಯ ಮೇಕ್ಸ್ ಕವರ್ಸ್ ಮೀ ಮೈ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ನೇಚರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ವಿಕ್ಷೇಪ ಶಕ್ತಿ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಥ್ರೋಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಓವರ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ that jagat is there ishwara is there jiva is there one jiva so many jivas are there 
how many jivas innu marbul jivas my god srishti prakaranam is a lot of prakaranam big prakaranam therefore therefore what agnyanam na jivashritam agnyanam is not in jiva final conclusion agnyasya agnyanam na ishvara ashrit ashritam it cannot be in ishvara also because before srishti we are talking Uh, ajnanam is uh, uh, ajnanam na jagadashritam jagat ishvara jeeva are going to come not at come srishte pur srishte he purvam ajnanam eva asit brahmana sah brahmashraya maya asti kada sada asti anadi avidya anirvachya anadi avidya rupam అది కారణ శరీరం డెఫినేషన్ కారణ శరీరం పుట్ ఆల్ కారణ శరీరం కారణ ప్రపంచ కారణ ప్రపంచ అనదర్ నేమ్ ఇస్ మాయ ఓకే సో ఆవృణమతి మీన్స్ విషయ సో రూమ్ ఈజ్ ద ఆశ్రయ ఆఫ్ డార్క్నెస్ రూమ్ ఈజ్ ద విషయ ఆఫ్ డార్క్నెస్ లైక్ దాట్ అంధకార విషయ గృహమేవ అంధకార ఆశ్రయ గృహమేవ తదేవ అజ్ఞాన విషయ బ్రహ్మ అజ్ఞాన ఆశ్రయ అప్పి బ్రహ్మ దట్ ఈస్ ద ఐడియా దెన్ లుక్ ఇన్ టు దట్ ఈస్ వాచస్పతి మిశ్రా సంక్షేప శారీరక వివరణ వేదాంత ముక్తావళి ఆల్ అదర్ ఆచార్యాస్ టూ గ్రూప్స్ ఐ సెడ్ the two groups uh, one group says um, uh, this is the very important i'll give the background for the next uh, um, what uh, topic 5257 two groups are there advaiti groups i said one group says brahma is the ashrayam for ajnanam moola ajnanam brahman is the vishaya for moola ajnanam this is uh, accepted by many advaita acharyas who are all there samshepa shariraka vivarana vedanta vedanta muktavali advaita siddhi advaita deepikaadi grandheshu in all these grandhas ajnanam swashraya vishayakam ivi iti varnitam this is the conclusion of uh, all these acharyas well, who are these acharyas i will give brief about their uh, writings so in uh, 257 we get uh, um, another acharya second group of advaitin vachaspati mishra if you understand that vachaspati mishra what he is going to say just i give briefly you know, what these uh, uh, sankshepa sharira karta vivarana karta all these acharyas come under group number 1 and 257 group number 2 acharya is a vachaspati mishra what he says vachaspati mishra differs from the this 256th view means group number 1 acharyas view brahman is the ashrayam for agnanam brahman is the vishaya for agnanam lokas is also brahman object of ignorance is also brahman this view i don't accept who says vachaspati mishra where he says in uh, the following uh, 257 which we are going to enter okay before that you should know what he want to say how why we negate other acharyas first group so this vachaspati mishra says jeeva is ashraya of ajnanam and brahman is the vishaya of ajnanam so ashraya is different vishaya is different for ajnanam brahman is not the ashraya vachaspati mishra says who is vachaspati mishra i will tell you later vachaspati mishra he is known as bhamatikara <laughs> how he gets that name also i will tell you bhamatikara vachaspati mishra says 
ajnanasya vishayaha brahma eva we also say that only advait in group number 1 but he differs the first opinion um, ajnanasya ashrayaha natu brahma parantu jeevaha eva that is what his contention so ajnanasya ashrayaha brahma न परंतु जीवः एव सो अज्ञानस्य आश्रयः जीवः अज्ञानम इज इन जीव हाउ इट इज इन जीव हि इज गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन लेटर ओके सो जीव इज द आश्रय फॉर अज्ञानम ब्रह्मन इज द विषय फॉर अज्ञानम नाउ सी द डिफरेंस फॉर फर्स्ट ग्रुप दिस आचार्यास बुक्स दे हैव ही हैज मेंशन संक्षेप शारीर का अनवर्स ग्रंथेशु ऑल दिस आर कम अंडर फर्स्ट ग्रुप फॉर होम विषया एंड आश्रया बोथ आर वन ब्रह्मन अलोम सो निचल दास जॉइंस विद दिस फर्स्ट ग्रुप टू फिफ्टी सिक्स्थ टॉपिक ग्रुप निचल दास जॉइंस सो वेर एज वाचस्पति मिश्रा भामति कारा अज्ञानस्य विषयः इज ब्रह्मन अज्ञानस्य आश्रयः जीवः इति उच्यते सो वाट निश्चलदास ईज जॉयनिंग विद दीज आचार्य स्वशब्देन दट ईज दट ईज द टॉपिक एक्चुअली स्वशब्देन शुद्ध ब्रह्म इति उच्यते तदेव ब्रह्म अज्ञानाश्रयः भवति तदेव ब्रह्म अज्ञान विषय चवती आव्रीयते चवती आव्रीयते विषय चवती तस्मा अज्ञान टू फिफ्टी सिक्स मिडिल पोर्शन ऐ जस्ट ऐ रेड लास्ट क्लास ऐ डिंट एक्सप्लेन सो तस्मा अज्ञान स्वाश्रय स्व विषयक उच्यते दट कप प्रत्यय बहुव्री सामस स्वाश्रय स्व विषय का मीन वाट एंडोड विथ असोसिएटेड विथ वाट ब्रह्मन एंड स्व विषय एंड स्वाश्रय स्वाश्रय स्व विषय अज्ञान से विषय ब्रह्म अज्ञान से आश्रय ब्रह्म इति उच्यते विषय इज ईक्वल टू आवृत आबजेक्ट आफ् इग्नरेन्स नौ हू इज दि संक्षेप शारीर खा कर्ता न संक्षेप शारीर का ईज ए सम्मरी ऑफ ब्रह्मसूत्र भाष्य ब्रह्मसूत्र भाष्य ईज रिटर्न बै आदिशंकराचार्य वी सा ब्रह्मसूत्र आल फै हंड्रेड फिफ्टी फै सूत्र इन इंग्लिश ई टुक् फोर सूत्र ई टुक् इन तेलुगु बेस्ड आन शंकराचार्य भाष्य ओके इट टुक् नियरली नईन इयर्स नईन इयर्स ई टुक् ब्रह्मसूत्र इन इंग्लिश because it is very big uh, then shariraka means brahma sutra bhashyam shariraka samkshepa samkshepa shariraka means summary of that brahma sutra bhashyam that is called samkshepa shariraka so samkshepa shariraka is a work written by sarvagnatma muni ये सम्मरी आन ब्रह्मसूत्र भाष्य ऑफ शंकराचार्य ओके ही राइट्स अज्ञान आश्रय विषय एक दट ईज ब्रह्म ओनली वन आचार्य फस्ट ग्रूप आचार्य देन सेकंड आचार्य ऑफ फस्ट ग्रूप विवरण विवरण वर्ड इज मेन्शन पंचपादिका विवरण I I I told you, no? I was, uh, long ago, I told you, you was long ago studied this this uh, uh, Vivarana, Bhamati, all this Brahma Sutra commentaries from uh, uh, Goda Shastriji. When I was, uh, doing this, uh, bhashyams, uh, uh, summaries of Vivarana, and at that time I was so confused first first few classes what is going on here i feel no 
Bhamati. Na so many commentaries are there for Brahma Sutra. So many commentaries. One Brahma Sutra book is available. Um, like a Natalagani Madri Philo, like it is. All this Vivarana, Bhamati, all comment commentaries are available in one Brahma Sutra book, Ratna Prabha. So many commentaries. So for Panchapadika Vivarana is written uh, was written by it is also a Panchapadika Vivarana Bhashya. Uh, Bhashya Vivarana. Vivarana of what? Vivarana of Shankaracharya Bhashya. So this Panchapadika Vivarana means a Vivarana on Shankara Bhashya. Samkshepa Sharirika written by Sarvagnatma Muni, whereas Panchapadika Vivarana written by Prakashatma Muni. Prakashatma Muni. All are Munis, great, great scholars, authors, which is um, um, a commentary on Panchapadika. Panchapadika commentary is a commentary on Brahma Sutra Bhashyam. Why Panchapadika? Panchapadika <laughs> is a book, uh, commentary, uh, sub-commentary written by Shankaracharya disciple Padmapada. So Padmapada wrote Panchapadika, a commentary on Adi Shankaracharya's Brahma Sutra Bhashya. I will repeat, on, on Vyasa Acharya's Brahma Sutras, Adi Shankaracharya wrote Bhashyam. On that Bhashya, Shankaracharya disciple wrote Padmapada, wrote Panchapadika. On that Panchapadika, E. Prakashatma Muni wrote Panchapadika Vivarana. So, commentary, 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 commentary. In the generations of there are generations of commentaries. Okay. Hmm? Its Bhashyam is called Panchapadika Brahma Sutra Bhashyam of Shankaracharya. Hmm? Bhashyam written by Adi Shankaracharya. Adi Bhashyam Panchapadika. Panchapadika Bhashyam Vivarana. Vivarana Kurta. Hmm? So Panchapadika Bhashya Vivarana. It is called. What uh, that is what a word is used here. Vivarana. Our Nichla Dasa or part of Vivarana is to poet. Vivarana and Naina, Nacholana Milio, and whatever I have learned from my Guru Paramarthananda Swami, I am sharing with you. Hmm. Therefore, all the greatness goes to my Guru. <laughs> Sankshepa Shari Rakakarta, Vivarana Karta, that means Sankshepa Shari Rakarta, Sarvagnatma Muni. Vivarana Karta Prakashatma Muni, then Vedanta Mukta Vadi, another Grantha. So there is one text written by Vedanta Mukta Vadi by Ramaraya Kavi also. This Ramaraya Kavi is a great, great author in Telugu. He wrote in Sanskrit only, but he belongs to Telugu, my place only. <laughs> My native place, Tem Taluka. Next to my place, there is a gramam called Pamidipadu. Uh, just 10 kilometers distance. That Pamidipadu, this Ramaraya Kavi, was a great uh, scholar. Of, um, first, he was Visistha Advaiti, then he became Advaiti. The Ramaraya Kavi, nearly, he wrote more than 100 books. He wrote Vedanta Muktavali. It is uh, written in sense Telugu script. Samaskritam only Vedanta Mukta Avali written in Telugu script. So that Telugu script was uh, transcribed into Sanskrit. And that means Sanskrit words are in Telugu script. Uh, Telugu script and Swamiji is telling, I cannot read Telugu. So one of our Swamiji student uh, transcribed that San Telugu words into Samaskritam. Samskritam words into Samskritam. So then Swami said, I could read that book, what Vedanta Muktavadi. So this Vedanta Muktavadi uh, written by Ramaraya Kavi. 
But that Ramaraya Kavi Vedanta Muktavali is not uh, mentioned here. This is another Vedanta Muktavali, Swamiji said. Because when this uh, Nishala Dasa wrote this book, uh, what Vichara Sagara, this Ramaraya Kavi of my place, Telugu, uh, only 10 to 12 years old. That's why this Vedanta Muktavali might not be the Ramaraya Kavi. Some other author might have written Vedanta Muktavali. So therefore, that Vedanta Muktavali Acharya also says uh, other than Ramaraya Kavi, some other Acharya. Therefore, uh, that author also accept this Agnanasya Ashraya Brahmayeva, Agnanasya Vishaya Api Brahmayeva, Ekameva Iti. Then next, Advaita Siddhi. Advaita Siddhi is a very advanced text written by Madhusudana Saraswati. Madhusudana Saraswati wrote, he himself wrote a commentary on Advaita Siddhi. He knows nobody can understand Advaita Siddhi. Very, very difficult, full of Nyaya, Tarka. This Advaita Siddhi, uh, Karta, Madhusudana Saraswati also accept only Ekashraya, Eka Vishaya, Eva Agnanasya. Agnanasya Vishaya, Brahmaeva, Agnanasya Ashraya, Happy, Brahmaeva. Who says Advaita Siddhi, Grantha Karta, Madhusudana Saraswati, great scholar. This Advaita Siddhi Karta, Madhusudana Saraswati alone wrote a commentary, Deepika, on his own Advaita Siddhi. So Advaita Deepika, the Adipadata, and many other Granthas also. Adi, in that Deepika also, what they said, Agnanam Swashraya Vishayakam Iti Varnitam. Agnanam Brahma is Swa Ashrayam Swa Vishayakam. Swa Ashrayam Swa Vishayakam. Where is its Ashrayam? Agnanasya Brahma. Swa so, Ashrayam. Where is the Vishaya? Its Ashraya only Vishaya for it. Therefore, Swa Vishayaka. Iti Varnitam is accepted, described, explained, mentioned by all, written by all these Advaita Acharyas group number one. So we are all in Advaita group number one. Okay? We are in Nishra Dasa party. Nishra Dasa party is Sankshepa Shari Raka Vivarana Vedanta Muktavali Advaita Siddhi Advaita Deepika. All these Acharyas, along with them, we are also joining one group number one. What is our conclusion? Ajnanam is locating in Brahman. Ajnanam is Avrutam, covering the Brahman. Okay. Now comes to 257. See how much depth is there in the 256 over. Now let me read. 257 Vachaspati Mishra, who is group number 2, is coming. Uktarthe Vachaspati Matam Agnanam Jeeva Mashritya Stitva Brahma Vishayi Karoti Agna Aham Agnaha Brahmana Janami Iti Anubhave Aham Iti Shabdartho Jeevaha Agnaha Iti Agnana Shrayatvena Pratiyate Tasma Jeevasya Agnana Shrayatvam Vekti Bhavati Brahmana Janami Iti Shabdaihi Agnana Sya Vishayaha Brahmeti Siddhyati Tathacha Agnanam Jeeva Shritam Sat Brahma Vishayi Karoti Avrunoti Iti Siddham Now the Vachaspati Mishra Group number 2 Acharya Upta Arthe Vachaspati Matam Upta Arthe means that above said topic Upta Arthe Whatever said until now until now, Ukta Arthe regarding that, regarding that, with regard to, with regard to Agnana Ashraya, Agnana Vishaya, 
వాచస్పతి మతం వాచస్పతి సేస్ హీ రైట్స్ ఏ వెరీ వెరీ అద్వైత స్కాలర్ వాచస్పతి మిశ్రా ఆల్సో ప్రొలెఫిక్ వేరో సమ్ వర్డ్ దే యూస్ ప్రొలెఫిక్ మీన్స్ వెరీ గ్రేట్ ఆథర్ ఆఫ్ అద్వైత హీ రోట్ ఏ కమెంటరీ ఆన్ బ్రహ్మసూత్ర కాల్డ్ భామతి ఇట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ భామతి దట్ వాచస్పతి మిశ్రా హీ సేస్ హీ రోట్ కమెంటరీస్ ఆన్ న్యాయ సాంఖ్య యోగ అండ్ వైశేషిక ఫర్ ఆల్ ఆఫ్ దెమ్ హీ రోట్ కమెంటరీస్ దిస్ వాచస్పతి మిశ్రా గ్రేట్ స్కాలర్ ఈవెన్ ద అదర్ సిస్టమ్ స్వామీజీ సేస్ ఈవెన్ ద అదర్ సిస్టమ్స్ ఆఫ్ ఫిలాసఫీ సాంఖ్య యోగ న్యాయ వైశేషిక పీపుల్ మేక్ యూజ్ ఆఫ్ దిస్ అద్వైత ఆచార్య వాచస్పతి మిశ్రాస్ రైటింగ్స్ ఆన్ దిస్ బుక్స్ on this topic subjects so vachaspati mishra commentaries they use so how great scholar he is you can imagine so this vachaspati mishra started writing brahma bhashya tika brahma sutra bhashya tika hmm? um, he was writing why it is called bhamati book pair it is called bhamati his brahma sutra bhashya tika is called bhamati because he is newly married uh, at that time he only he started writing this book brahma sutra bhashya tika uh, he was writing 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 he, f- he has forgotten that he has married so that wife daily serving the food bringing everything to him and uh, he is go on writing writing he never saw her face also properly hmm? while he has completed the book uh, uh, after completing the book uh, he just relaxed and raised his head then he saw one woman is standing with white hair an you know, old lady hmm? who are you he asked then she smiled she is so happy at least my husband is looking at me today hmm? i am your wife bhamati she said then uh, he was very much regretted so i have neglected you i have ignored you in my writings uh, this book therefore i want to um, put your name so that as long as my writing is there people will remember you because of your services only i could write this brahma sutra bhashya tika uh, achaspati mishra says therefore it is known as bhamati kara that brahma sutra bhashya tika has got another name bhamati bhamati kara uh, so later i come to know after the starting studying that bhamati from that shastri ji then i come to know the story later swami ji also told that vachaspati mishra is this vachaspati mishra whom we are studying now what is his opinion adida mukhya ipo namaku okay agnyanam jeeva maashritya aashritya mein sthitva brahma vishay karoti now he is going to take to brahma aashrayam agnyanasya aashrayam అజ్ఞానస్య విషయ బ్రహ్మణ అజ్ఞానస్య విషయ బ్రహ్మ ఓకే ఐ యాక్సెప్ట్ దాట్ బట్ బ్రహ్మ అజ్ఞానస్య ఆశ్రయ తు జీవ హిసేస్ వై హీ గివ్స్ ద రీజన్ అహం అజ్ఞ బ్రహ్మ న జానామి ఐ డు నాట్ నో బ్రహ్మన్ ఐఎమ్ ఇగ్నరెంట్ ఆఫ్ బ్రహ్మన్ ఇన్ లయ ఇన్ డీప్ స్లీప్ we are all experience agnyanam or not i slept well i don't i did not know anything i did not know anything anna i did not know anything anna eng irukke and agnyanam anna in me only in a laya when i am sleeping in me only it is there therefore it is jeeva he has taken similarly in pralaya also agnyanam is in jeeva only because jeeva sar anadi agnyanam is anadi so agnyanam resting where in jeeva only 
That is why jivas are telling, Aham Ajnaha, Vachaswat Mishra says, Brahmana jana me, I do not know Brahman. Illa in the party and what in the party, Yara is all run on Brahman Triya, the Brahman Triya, Atma Agnan, Eric Erkan. Correct than his woman, watches for the Mishra, the correct and it thorn, yeah, said Nanya Perikim. Jana, it would say they people say that Aham it is Shabdartha, Jeeva, Nan in a kitta, Eric and a Kula, Brahma Agnan, Eric and Jeevan Dane. The Shabda Thaha Jeevaha Agnaha Iti He is ignorant Iti Agnanam Ashrayatvena Pratiyate Pratiyate means evident Everyone is evident All students are evident only Jeevas What? I do not know Brahman, I do not know Atma, I do not know Brahma I do not know Brahma so, Vajaspati Mishra group will not be able to do it. People all will join there only. Okay. We'll see details in the next class. Om Pur Namada Pur Namidam Pur Nath Pur Namadachate Pur Nasya Pur Namadaya Pur Nameva Vasishyate Om Shanti 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 Harihi Om Shri Guru Bhyo Namaha Hari he om.